Shiba Inu coin is holding up nicely at 54, 5,500 points per coin. We had a little bit of a rally this morning, and now we've got support at 5,300 points per coin if it decides to fall back a little bit. But guys, it is no surprise that demand is fading a little. After you get any sort of a, just a frenzied rally like we saw in October, it's completely normal and completely natural to watch people take their profits, to watch, you know, kind of the excitement die down a little bit. So we can go over some of the reasons we might see that happening. But more importantly, we should talk about the numbers on trends.google.com because it is obvious that less people are searching for Shiba Inu coin, but just how much less people are searching for Shiba Inu coin and where Google expects it to go. So if all of this sounds like something you're interested in, let's get started. What's up everybody, I'm Clay, I'm here to make 2021 the best year ever. If you haven't clicked that subscribe button, make sure to subscribe to the channel, join us, become a bro. We are here every single day and we are growing our portfolios together. And look, if you're brand new to investing or you don't know where to buy Shiba Inu coin, you can use the link in the description for Weeble. It is super simple to set up an account and with a $100 deposit, you get two free stocks and then any $1 crypto trade, you get at least $5 in free Shiba Inu coin. And they did extend that throughout next week, so I believe until 11.17. November 17th, you can get that free $5 in, in Shiba Inu coin. And if you don't live inside the United States, you can use the international Binance link in the description below. But guys, we've seen a pullback, 8,800 points down to around 4,300 points. We moved back into the fives, back down into the fours, back into the fives again. And it seems like Shiba Inu coin is trying to find out where the market is accepting it right now. But just to talk about fading demand, okay? We had a rally that was unrivaled in October. Shiba Inu coin more than 10x throughout October, going from roughly six, 700 points per coin all the way up to 8,800 points per coin. Now, this was very much so driven by speculation. If you watch the video that I posted earlier, you saw things like Robinhood, FOMO, Elon Musk, uh, you know, no shorting, a, a bunch of reasons why it would have ran up. And if you look at each one of those reasons, they are purely speculative. All right. A lot of people jumping on because of news that wasn't confirmed because other people were driving the price higher, those FOMO buyers and so on. So after a speculative run like that, people take profits and then people uh, that are more on the conservative side, decide when to get back into Shiba Inu coin. It is natural. It happens. It is nothing to be worried about. Because as soon as the price rises again, it will be the exact same thing, and this time, perhaps at a much bigger level. So if we compare the October run to what we saw in May, Shiba Inu coin drastically ran higher in May, reaching about 3,400 points per coin before pulling back and all the way down to 500 points per coin. And then retested that 34, 3,500 level in October, blew on by it, drove all the way to 8,800 points per coin before Shiba Inu coin decided to pull back even more. And it's, it was sitting around 4,300 points per coin, and it's still finding that level. All right, it's still, Shiba Inu coin is still finding the level where investors think that it's cheap. And when that happens, it will set up a base. And then as long as the Shiba army doesn't go anywhere and new investors begin to view Shiba Inu coin as a cheap investment, then the money will start pouring in again. And this, the, the, I was almost going to say stock price, but the price of the coin will start rising again. So it, it's just, it's cyclical in nature. Nothing goes up and goes up forever. But the, the pullback we're seeing is simply because people are, I don't know, reanalyzing re where they believe Shiba Inu coin is, is purchasable and how low they think it's going to go. So talking about demand, talking about hype and so on, if you go out to trends.google.com and you look at the search volume for Shiba Inu coin, all right, that's one of the most searched uh, terms on YouTube. It's one of the most searched terms on Google in referencing Shiba Inu coin. You can see that about two weeks ago, it peaked at around its 
Google trends.go.com is, is very difficult to understand if you're not used to it, but it peaked around a hundred. That means that's the most volume, most search volume that that search term has ever had. So it peaked around a hundred and then it fell back to around 66, 67, and it is expected to decline again from there. Now, Google does a very good job of predicting its analytics. They know and they've been doing this forever, right? So the search term Shiba Inu coin is expected to fall all the way back down to 44 this week. That is a great decline from the weeks prior. And it's very indicative of what the price action is doing as well. So it's almost impossible to determine if the price is mirroring the search volume or if the search volume is mirroring the price. The the two graphs, they coincide very well. But as the search volume or the demand decreases, the price decreases as well. So we're seeing a little bit of a pullback this week and we may be experiencing consolidation in the price of Shiba Inu coin. We need to get demand higher if we ever expect prices in Shiba Inu coin to go back up. How do we do it? Okay, we've got people out there pumping Shiba Inu coin. We've got the Shiba burn party. We've got all these different websites that are promoting Shiba now. We are doing what we need to do. But as soon as people jump back on board and that price starts rising, the price is the biggest driver of demand that you are going to see out there. The FOMO reaction to anything running, especially when it's got as much potential as Shiba Inu coin does, really drives eyes into what's happening here. Should I get involved? Should I invest my money? And they need to go out and they need to do their research and then they determine whether or not they should be buying Shiba Inu coin. So as the price consolidates, we need to see more and more people coming back and getting excited about Shiba Inu coin again, not just viewing it as, okay, it's going to calm down right now and then I get in. When that FOMO kicks off, guys, the demand will kick off and it's an endless cycle that goes back and forth and then we reach these all-time highs. It doesn't have to happen overnight, absolutely not. If you're actually expecting prices like a uh, you know, quarter of a penny, half a cent, one cent per Shiba Inu coin, you need to be long-term focused. The supply is very high. To reach these points is very difficult, so you need to be longer-term focused if you're looking at that. But if you're in it for the volatility, if you're in Shiba Inu coin because of these short-term gains, we have to keep our eyes on demand. So guys, I want to know what you think down in the comments below. Let me know not only how high you think AMC, or AMC not, not only how high you think Shiba Inu coin can go, but when you think the demand will return. Is there going to be some more demand we got coming in uh, in November or is it going to have to be some Christmas party type deal where we got Shiba Inu coin buyers really rallying at the end of 2021 and if this button is still red make sure to click it subscribe to the channel join us become a bro we are here every single day and we are growing our portfolios together Weeble and Binance down in the description below if you haven't already signed up for there Claybro883 on Twitter and Instagram and until the next time hope that each and every one of you have an awesome day